I found out that prelims is more about guesswork, of course, but that too very uh, smart guesswork. It's not possible for any person to learn each and everything. Right, the the UPSC syllabus is so vast. It is like an infinite portion that no one can actually master over it. So what you need exactly is that you should have that particular. Uh, I mean, you should be able to make sense that what kind of questions does UPSC exam actually asks, and that can be judged on the basis of the past year papers. So if you actually go through the past year papers. UPSC uh, follows a certain pattern. This is what I could make out that if you are able to identify the pattern, then you will be able to make out and trace that this particular uh, subject or this particular topic is more important. The other one is least important. So then you will actually channelize your energies towards the most important topics. And even if you leave out the least important topics. then also you will be able to moderately attempt on the basis of the limited knowledge you have so then actually i started categorizing my questions into most important moderately important and least important talking about mains exam i missed my second attempt of prelims by 0.5 so that time my ultimate ob- objective was that next time when i'll appear for this exam i have to make sure that i am not writing this prelims again this kind of uh, this thought was in my mind that next attempt will be my last attempt uh, treat mains as something which you will not appear again don't make it a kind of habit that i'll uh, that this time i'll just do casually uh, i'll appear for mains casually and next time i'll see if you are cl- clearing prelims then either you should be well prepared before or you should study so laboriously that you are able to clear it in that attempt itself because according to me if if certain people can relate to this prelims is actually very unpredictable exam you cannot actually get through it just like that when during previous years when csat was a part of prelims exam till then it was bit easy bit casual but now when they are asking only current affairs so it has become so tricky so my advice to all the upsc aspirants will be that if you are able to clear a prelims exam then make this a, a point in your mind that mains exam should be approached very laboriously and with full effort since uh, in my second attempt itself then i started working hard for my mains during uh, my second uh, attempt preparation i started focusing on my optional subject the most optional subject matters the most when it comes to mains you have to be master in your optional subject my optional subject was commerce and accountancy since i was already a commerce graduate and uh, even my masters is in mcom so i chose this subject very wisely so another important advice choose your optional subject very wisely don't follow uh, the advice given by coaching institutes that they will be offering you the best coaching so follow this optional follow that optional just feel just understand your strength that what subject you can be good at and that is possible only on the basis of the past year papers so go through the past year papers and try to think that if you have to do if you have to answer this particular question whether your mind is ready to tackle this subject in detail or not because optional subject actually needs mastery third important thing is the art of answer writing answer writing matters the most because you have to answer so many questions in limited hours in limited number of words so there are so many conditions put forward so when you are actually preparing for mains exam make this a habit that you will be writing answers frequently on regular schedules right so art of answer writing i guess uh, that in itself is a great uh, requires a uh, great conversation i won't be i won't be burdening you with so much information at this go itself the fourth point the fourth important point for uh, mains preparation would be essay and ethics 
these two are uh, important papers that aspirants generally miss out they think they'll be able to do it at the last moment but when they actually uh, encounter these in their mains exam they feel that their preparation is actually missing so essay ethics the the ignorant part of the upsc exam that should be prepared well in advance so it's all about managing the entire uh, mains syllabus because each and everything is very important don't think that this subject can be left out that thing can be left out so make a very organized schedule of how you are preparing and the most important thing i'll repeat again optional subject be very um, wise while choosing your optional subject and master over it